TV, KMBC DT, Kansas City. Thanks, Kansas City, for making us number one. This is KMBC 9 News. Coverage you can count on. Do you have an invention you think you could sell? Well, tonight, inventors and entrepreneurs from all over North America are here in the metro trying to win the opportunity to have their product marketed and sold to you and me. The NBC 9's Aaron Little joins us live tonight from the Kaufman Foundation with a look at some of those inventions. Aaron? Some great inventions and inventors from all over the country. Hundreds of them applied to come to Kansas City. Only 15 actually made it, and they'll be competing tonight for one winner who will get to market and retail their product. And I think this one's going to appeal to a lot of folks who are back to schoolers, which I know many of you are. Michael and Ryan, you guys invited these backpacks, right? That's right. Okay, so now turn around and show us. It's not just a normal backpack, right? No, it isn't. It's a uh, combination scooter and backpack uh, integrated into each other. So why a scooter backpack? Well, we pretty much got tired of uh, carrying multiple books and laptops and other folders around and figured, well, if we're rolling a piece of luggage, why can't we just ride it? And I think the first thing that comes to mind when I see a scooter backpack is that's going to take a half hour to unload the scooter and to get going where you're, you know, it's going to take a lot of time. But I think Ryan's going to show us here how quick this actually is with your product. That's right. And just to set the tone, uh, for a college student, imagine you wake up in the morning and you're late for class and you've got several books in your bag ready to go but it takes 10 minutes to walk there instead of walking yeah the bag comes off your back board automatically deploys you ride and to your destination and he's off and you've got no stress on your back whatsoever a lot of folks are experiencing chronic back injuries from carrying too many books especially little children and now when you've reached your building you step off board automatically flips up locks bag goes on your back and you're ready to go up the steps or into your building or whatever. And it's really not heavy either. You were saying about 8 to 10 pounds for the scooter, and the backpack's not much more, right? Right. In this model, the scooter is a heavy-duty, adults-only scooter and weighs about 8 pounds. And so lighter weight materials could be used to reduce that. And based on the shape of the bag, it actually comforts the back as it wears it. Very good. Well, good luck with you guys tonight, and I'm sure you guys are going to do really well. That appeals to all of the folks who have back-to-schoolers. Now, here in Kansas City, it's hot right now, but the snow is coming. We have this really inventive snow shovel that will help you to shovel show here in Kansas City. We'll show you that coming up tonight at 6. Back to you guys. <laughs> wow. It will be then. timely before you know it. How about yeah. that scooter? <laughs> well, you know, the, idea. the thing they said is this model, so there's got to be more than one. They're thinking wow. about a series of those yeah. things. And I just want to say to my daughters, remember, they're not available yet, so don't put them on your back-to-school <laughs> yet, list yeah. yet, but they would like that, I'm sure. That's a great idea.